To the greatest sailors, Marines, and civilian teammates in the world, thank you for all your dedicated professionalism in the face of this global pandemic. You've heard me say that the most predictable thing that we can say about the future is that it will be unpredictable. The last few months have proven that to be true. As I wrote to you on Friday, we must be ready at all times, not just as an organization, but as individuals, to exhibit the personal qualities of speed, transparency, adaptability, collaboration, humility, trust, and a healthy dose of skepticism. And that's exactly what you've done in fulfilling our many missions, from getting the mercy and the comfort prepared in record time to the quarantine efforts at Miramar and elsewhere, to the logistics and security efforts that are underway around the world, to the personal responsibility of you all taken to prevent the spread of this disease on our bases and ships. And through it all, you've kept the watch on our primary security mission, executing the national defense strategy, no matter what curveball history may throw our way. Every one of you stands ready, willing, and more than capable to protect the American people and defend this nation. It is what we all signed up for, to serve a cause greater than ourselves, to protect our democracy and our very way of life. And I'm proud of the military families who have faced additional burdens through travel restrictions and other challenges. I am keenly aware that for your families, social distance is not a new concept, but a daily reality during deployments. The new realities we face have only added to that burden. Please know that your families are at the top of my mind and we are committed to doing everything we can to keep them healthy and safe as we minimize the disruptions to their daily lives. We remain ever grateful for their service as well as yours. The Navy and Marine Corps have always stepped forward to protect the United States of America in its greatest time of need, and I'm inspired and honored to join you in that cause today. Together, we will get through this and emerge on the other side as a stronger and more agile Navy and Marine Corps team, and as a result of that, a far more resilient nation. Thank you so much for all you do every day. Don't give up the ship.